Okay, here's another uh, automations and progress on the script on creating uh, a P-trap or S-trap. This is the floor waste and then connecting to the main pipe. So usually we have uh, different orientations of the pipe, the start point and the end point. So this one, if we transfer it here. So if you check this one, it's the sloping will be from this point. This is the start point and then the end point. This is the start point and end point. Okay. So this is a uh, typical so orientation. Is there are no fixed orientation of the main pipe where is the start point and end point. So I modified the script and this one I will share the script, uh, script so you can check also and then apply it in your process so previous uh, script that I made is this one so as you can see here we have two uh, branch pipe connecting to the main and then the main pipe this one is start point from here going to here and then the start point is from here to here. So currently for the first uh, number of script, it doesn't matter. It will connect automatically because this is a direct connection. I select this one, select the branch, and I play. It will align to this one. Okay, so if I type TM, it will, it will go along the curve. I mean, yes, along the slope. So, check this one also. Let's do it again. So, this one is lower and this is higher than the main pipe. So, I already modified the script. So, if I select the main pipe, the branch pipe, play, to align, TM, and then it, the, the push, I mean, the direction also of the uh, fittings going here top and bottom so the same with this one if I select the main pipe the branch pipe play so the same and then if I type TM it will create a fittings like that so if we go here another script so this one will be create a 45 degree a white trap uh, y fitting sorry so the same concept but on different uh, opposite sides I mirror this one so if I select this one edit select the main pipe branch pipe and this one will be the the offset of the um, all this the offset from the main pipe to the 45 degree connection pipe okay so if I play this one so this will be the current uh, output so as, it, as you can see here some of this one it will not automate even though I already created a uh, few things to connect this one in the dynamo script so again if I press trim and then I just press TM it's perfect perfectly aligned See, now this is the Y now. So, it's going this this way because I already uh, sort the top and then the, uh, the, I mean the start and end point. That's why it's going. So, it, if you check the other pipe, this one, it's going to the opposite side also. So, it will go to the other side. So, let's try that one. This main pipe. Select the branch. And then play. So, as you can see, that it will go also to the opposite sides based on the direction of this slope. Okay? So, you just press uh, trim and then TM, trim multiple, and then it's connected. So, that's how you can automate all the processes in uh, sanitary, especially in sanitary. So, it's not limited. Once you master this one, uh, you can apply it to multiple uh, integrations, especially in working in Revit. Okay, so let's try also this one here. If there are issues, as you notice that 
as we run, it will not automate or create a fittings here. So, but let's try to finish all this uh, branch and main pipe connector here. So again, let's try this one. And then the branch, play. So sometimes it will create a uh, disconnect. It's, it's okay. So what you need to do is just select the P-trap, uh, connect N2, and then this one is already connected, and then this trim again, and then TM. Uh, okay, so it's perfectly aligned again. So the slope is going from here until here. So, see? So this is, uh, although this is a, a small process in sanitary working, but it will uh, speed up the process of the modeling. It's, it, it can save time um, to the project. Uh, okay. It will give you also uh, more time to, you know, check other uh, issues, coordinations for this one. For the sanitary. So again, let's try the finish all. So this is the main. And then this is the branch. And then if you want to add additional space, the from the main and the angle of the 45 degree pipe you can add uh, let's say 400 here it will be a uh, much uh, more space so again disconnect this one so you just select connect into this pipe here trim and then you just press tm and then it's connected also so, so that's uh, some uh, issues you, we will encounter in modeling in uh, uh, sanitary piping. So imagine if you modeling it ma by manual, no? it will take time, it will consume time. So to, to model each uh, toilet. Okay, so I select the main pipe, select the branch. So I'll make it smaller. So let's say I, I put it back again to uh, 300 I'm okay with 300 and then play go disconnect again so connect into doesn't matter it's still connect faster and then TM okay so the slope again we starting from this point going to this point so it's way faster and also, it doesn't matter if this branch pipe is lower and the, or above the main pipe. The script will auto-align this one. So, select the main pipe. Select the branch pipe. Run. So, again, do we have cutter issue? Don't worry. Connect N2. And then trim. And then trim multiple. Okay. So, okay, let's finish this one. Branch. Let's connect. So, this one is another uh, process. Now, if you have these two pipes here, first branch, second branch, and before connecting here. So, if you have this one uh, issue, then we just refresh this one and then you select this main script. And then you select the main, select the branch, and then play. It will align now and trim. Trim. Trim multiple. And there you go. You have it's connected only. So again, if you so you can also do like this, select this one, select the branch, and play. Let's connect. I think I, I will not use that process. Go back here at the 45 degree. Select the main. Select the branch. Play. So you disconnect. So it's telling that this is a disconnect. You can just trim this one. So it's now connected. So this one, as you can see, the fitting is automatically created. Okay. It depends on the orientation of the pipe. So again, for this one here, select the main pipe, select the branch pipe, run, 
disconnect it's okay so you can trim this one and then trim multiple okay and then go back here main pipe branch and then play trim okay that's it that's how quickly you can connect all the branch and main pipes disconnect mm -hmm. so it's not it's telling me it's not connected anymore okay I think I I made a mistake in the process go back here first at the 45 degree select main select the branch play disconnect so trim so this one uh, it already automatically created a few things so sometimes it will go by your uh, script or sometimes it will not so you just have to uh, be a uh, creative creative and then continue with your workflow don't stuck yourself in trying to solve anything everything okay so that's how you can automatically collect all connect all the branches in sanitary with a 45 degree i mean uh y connection 45 degree y connection so i think that's it uh okay let's show the script <clears throat> if i show you the script uh, it's, it's a huge script so this is the script here it's massive uh. i mean i cannot fit it in the whole screen i have many integration for this one from the previous uh, script also so that's the whole script okay i will po post the link and you can just grab the script and then check it by yourself okay so that's it thank you